How are you guys doing today? Today, on Tuna Tech, we've got an item that is definitely an upgrade, but isn't something as glamorous as some other tech. <laughs> So what am I talking about? It's kind of like if you have a car and needs an oil change or new tires. It's something you need. You can definitely get an upgrade, better oil, better tires, but it's not flashy and it's not awesome, but it is peace of mind. And this little piece of tech that I have is definitely one of those things. Today, I'm gonna go over probably the most affordable mesh Wi-Fi 6E router available in the market today. Now, I say maybe because I'm not quite sure. This unit right here is sold at Costco. So if you're familiar with Costco as like Sam's Club, you have to have a membership to be able to purchase at a special price. This is $349.99 out the door. Now, I say out the door, plus tax, of course. But either way, interestingly enough, this is a tri-band, six gigahertz, five gigahertz, 2.5 or 2.4 gigahertz router mesh style from TP-Link. I currently use the TP-Link M5, which is only a dual band uh, router, but this is something that I've been itching to get my hands on and it looks pretty promising. So what do we have here? This can connect up to 200 devices at once it has Wi-Fi 6E. So they're claiming 2,402 megabytes per second with six gigahertz. Um, same with five gigahertz and 516 megahertz with, or megabytes with 2.5, four gigahertz band. It covers with the three up to 7,200 feet. Um, it's got parental controls, uh, TP-Link home shield and AI driven mesh network. Um, it says here it's a brand new six gigahertz band opens up the fastest possible seed, speeds, lowest ever latency and unprecedented capacity. Uh, obviously uh, some things you have to think about in general with 2.4 gigahertz which is your slowest speed but it has your widest range. Five gigahertz is the next step down and six will probably be even more limited but you'll be have your faster speeds. Uh, with three you can with three of these you can cover 7200 square feet. And it says you can reach gigabyte speeds and stream flawless video, even as you explore alt, you know, AR and VR worlds. It can connect up to 200 devices, which is very important. For me, at least, I use a lot of home, smart home products, and most of mine are Wi-Fi enabled, as well as a ton of my other Wi-Fi enabled devices like TVs, phones, laptops, uh, smart devices, home devices. So the more the merrier. Uh, as you, if you reach the max of your router's connectivity, you will see dropouts, slower speeds. So this is something that would definitely upgrade for me. It says it uses AI-driven mesh, so it's a self-learning uh, uh, software to help you know where you are in the house and how the device will connect to it. Like I said, I have the Deco M5, which is quite a bit older than this one, and I've. When I initially set it up, there were some issues of connecting, but they are great. TP-Link is great at sending out firmware updates, and I've had nothing but great success with that with that um, that product. So it has a home shield. It says protect your network and everything on it. TP-Link's premium security services keeps your home network safe with cutting-edge features for network and Internet of Things protection. Now that is a subscription service, I believe, and I'm assuming this will come with a you know, a certain length of time for a free trial of that. It has robust parental controls. It has quality of service, so it prioritizes the bandwidth needed to get faster networking experience to base, uh, uh, based on what device is using it. It gives you comprehensive reports and statistics on how your internet's being used. And it, it, with, with Alexa, which I don't really use that much, you, there is some voice control features with that. And like I said, it's very simple to use. You install the app, which I already have because I have a, a TP-Link product and you set it up and go. So with that being said, I'm not really gonna go too far into that, but let's just look at the box here. You see the Deco, 
tri-band mesh Wi-Fi 6C router system. It's the AXE5300, and it does all, it, it lists out the speeds. Now, these are dependent on your local internet, but here we have cable, and I am using Spectrum here in the US. It's got a two-year warranty. We'll slip this around here. So here's what I was telling you about. Tri-band uses AI to determine, you know, what needs what. Uh, it says Wi-Fi dead zone killer. It's got the home link, or home shield in, uh, included, network protection, parental controls, quality of service, comprehensive reports, seamless roaming with one Wi-Fi name. So you don't have to have with mesh. It's nice because you can have one Wi-Fi name and it will cover the entire house. It's not an extender. It's a mesh network, which is pretty good. So, and it is backwards compatible and supports wi all Wi-Fi generations and devices. So my only thing I don't know about for sure is, will this connect and integrate with my current Deco M5s? Because I do have an, a Deco out in my garage, which I'd like to keep out there. And since it's an older device, having to deal with the cold and the heat, I'd rather leave that one out here and leave the new ones inside. But that's for a different video if we decide to do it. So let's just cut this thing open. Yes, this is my Smith & Wesson stubby knife here. It's my everyday carry for work. So we'll get this all unpackaged here. So, like I said, I'm a very big fan of TP-Link. Um, just to, it does, from what I understand, it does have the backhaul capabilities. Um, some people care about that, some people don't. My current Deco does not have it, and I've never had any issues but it's just something to think about. So I opened it upside down, of course. So I'm gonna get this going here. And inside, you have your three Deco units. Now, my Deco M5s are round discs. I'll put a picture up here off the side somewhere so you can see a com uh, kind of a comparison. They are slimmer and like pancake style and they're a lot slimmer. So they do fit in better places than this. These are quite large, which is kind of a downside, but let's pull them out and look at them. So you got your grill on the bottom and you do have three network ports mine currently have two and that comes in handy because wherever this is set you can use it as a hardwired device as well and then there's the top it's got some plastic coating on top i'll just leave that on for now and i'm going to assume these are all the same which they should be and you choose which one you want to be the main unit and the other two connect to it that's how i set up my last one so there's three of them in, like i said there's three of them here and they cover 7,200 square feet, which is a lot bigger than what I need, but I always say more is better. So inside the box, we also got, you have a network cable and some quick installation guides. I mean, if you really want to see the cable, I can pull it out, but it's just a cable there. Then you have three of these large, very large plugs. Not small, but like I said, you guys remember, these devices are on all the time. And this is one of those things, again, it's Wi-Fi, it's not glamorous, it's not sparkly, but it's something we have to have for internet of things and smart homes and the current future home. So having a quality, although large, plug could be a good thing if it tends to last longer. And that's about it, you guys. That's the unboxing experience. It is three power cables, a network cable installation guide, and three nodes, if that's what you want to call them. And they do support 6E. So I know TP-Link has other multi several, several models. This one is the one they offer at um, Costco. And it isn't their highest end, but it's 6E at a super affordable price. Most of the routers that I've looked at from other companies can be in excess of $800,000, $900,000. So I'm going to give this a shot. If you guys want to know more about this, leave a comment below and maybe I can uh, do an update on this and compare it to the M5, which I currently use. But like I said, this is the Deco 6E router. This is the AXE 5300 at Costco starting at $349 plus tax USD. Leave a comment down below. Catch you next time.